Yes, this is the residence of Mr. David Kolowitz, the famous actor. No, this is Marlowe, the butler. Who's calling, please? Ah, Miss Garbo. No, I'm afraid Mr. Kolowitz cannot come to the phone just now. Pardon? What? Yes, of course I can tell you why not. He's a screwing Dolores Del Rio. That's why he cannot speak to you. He's screwing Dolores Del Rio and may not be disturbed till he's through. No, he can't call you back at 5.30. At 5.30 he humps Alice Faye. Then Gene Harlow at 7, Mae West at 11, and somewhere between them Faye Ray. No, tomorrow I fear is no better. He'll be banging Gene Arthur at 10. Carol Lombard at one, Myrna Loy, Irene Dunn, half an hour for dinner and then. He's booked solid till midnight at which time it's Dolores Del Rio again. Yes, I could set you up an appointment, but the waiting list's endless, I fear. Ruby Keeler's been waiting six months now, Betty Davis for over a year. No, next Friday is out of the question. Cancellations are simply unknown. There's Miss Dietrich, and then it is time for Miss Bennett. No, Constance, on Tuesday it's Joan. No, next Wednesday you haven't a hope, miss. He stoop Sylvia Sydney at four. Then may Murray may Clark, and then after it's dark, with Lamour and Lamar it's Amor. And as usual, just as a nightcap, it's Dolores Del Rio on board. Oh, there might be an opening in April If you promise you won't take too long You go right after Madeline Carroll and just before Anna May Wong. Oh, no, wait, that's not any good either. I'd forgotten these penciled in dates. There's Joan Crawford, and then he must meet Sonia Henny. They're going to try it on skates. <laughs> Please, it's no good your weeping, Miss Garbo. And it's no use your taking that towel. You can wave, you can rant, Mr. Kolowitz can't. Simply can't come and talk on the phone. He's screwing a Dolores Del Rio. And he wants to be, well, you know, a law.